Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Mid Level Media, and we are here today. What are we here to do? Um, I think you said we're gonna go to Barnes and Noble. And Barnes check out and the Noble. Criterion sale. The Criterion sale. You got to put your pinky up when you say it. The Criterion. 50% off sale. So yeah. this will be my trip number two. Uh, now when I put in my first video, it said trip number one. And I remember you said to me, that'll be the only one. I did. Or you sent me a message or something. And here I am. And here you are with me for trip number two. But uh, yeah, I'm excited to get in here. This is a different location than I went to for trip number one. Uh, we actually came here together like a year and a half ago and you picked out some criterions for me. And guess what? We still haven't watched them. And we still haven't watched them. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna let you do that again. Okay. Uh, but maybe I'll allow you to influence some purchases if you see something that you uh, like or think that we should have in the collection. Hmm. Uh, I, I don't know if you will, but I've I've got my own list. It's like uh, I made like a ten movies I hope to get in November from Criterion, like a Criterion wish list video. Gotcha. Uh, so I'm I'm trying to stay on track with that. Um, but who knows? Who How knows? many have you got so far? I got five oh. last week. All right. I got five last week. So I need to at least get, uh, well, two of them's new really Wally and Malcolm X. I'm going to get next week and that's counted in that. So I, I'm thinking I may get three today and that'll be pretty much it for me. So, okay. um, but yeah, I'm excited to get in. Let's get in here. Let's buy some criterions. Let's go. Got Michelle over there taking a picture of Barnes and Noble. It's cold, it's it's rainy, it's icy, but that's not going to keep us from, from our criterions, is it, babe? You know, you can't, you can't keep Ken from the <laughs> criterions. Hell no, look at that, Barnes and Nobles. Booksellers, not today. They're going to sell me some movies. Looks like they have a bunch of new criterions. New 4Ks, I have most of these. They do have this fog steel book from Scream Factory, so that's pretty cool. Um, they have the parasite that I wanted, but it's uh it's DVD. Ooh. Who buys DVDs for thirty bucks? Why? Why would you do that? Oh, nice, Gone with the Wind. I, I have that. I have oh, that. Yeah, you yeah, we can watch Gone with the Wind anytime. I got uh, the, or we the, the Dracula. Okay, 4K last steel book. Last I checked, these weren't Criterion's. No, they got regular movies too. They got regular movies. But here it is. This is the section. This is the big Criterion section. Look at that. It goes all the way down. And then you got all that stuff on the bottom. Oh, my. Now let's dig in. Let's see. We got uh, we got Dazed and Confused. Nobody buy this. Nobody buy this. It just got announced for 4K. So don't, don't buy Dazed and Confused. You see anything you like over here? I have not even looked. You haven't looked? No. You're supposed to be looking. We got uh, Summertime. Which one? Ooh, I do kind of want that. That's the Royal Tenenbaums. Yeah, the art, the we art always gets me. Just we started to watch that like a year ago, and then we didn't finish it. <laughs> I'd seen it before, but... These are all Wes Anderson. Royal Tenenbaums, Rushmore, Bottle Rocket, Darlene oh, Unlimited. Looks like somebody got a whole Wes Anderson stack and just decided to put it back. Mm -hmm. I said, "Screw Wes Anderson, Hacks him. That's pretty creepy. I do want that. That's a that's a horror movie from I think the uh, 1922. This is one that I wanted. Buck and the Preacher. I got this Bruce Lee collection. 124.99. That'd be a good deal. Be down to 62 something. Agnes Varda. I felt some. I heard some good things about the Melvin Van Peebles set. Let's see. City Lights. I do want to get at some point. Um, Credible Shrinking Man. I think I already got that one. I think I got this one last year. The Brood. I would like to get The Brood. David Cronenberg. Probably one of the better David Cronenberg movies. Uh, Devil in the Blue Dress. This is one that I wanted and I actually forgot to put on my list, so I might get this today. 
I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. What else do we got? Uh, Hard Day's Night. Uh, I think that's the Blu-ray. This is the Blu-ray. I had no idea that was a big Digipack edition. That's the 4K that came out this year. I know it had some problems. When it came out, there were some issues. I can't remember what they were. That's a cool set, though. Trying to look down here to see if they... Yep, they have it. Parasite. This one's on Blu-ray. I, I have to get this. I've been skipping out on this one for the longest time, and I have to grab this one today for sure. Here's Eve's Bayou. I've been hearing good things about, uh, about this one as well. Do want to get that. Eraserhead. This is a cool addition. I had this one already, though. I have most of the uh, David Lynch stuff. Uh, let's see. Fayadaya, I think that just came out. Uh, For All Mankind, I also wanted. That's the 4K. Don't think I'll grab it today, though. Uh, Frown Land, this is a recent release. Yep, here it is. This is the, the Safdie Brothers film. Daddy Long Legs. I believe that one just came out recently as well. And then we got uh, Pop. That's a big box set. I don't know what it, what that is. In the Mood for Love on 4K. That one just came out. I like the cover on this one, Mary Lee, We Go to Hell. Heard good things about Minding the Gap as well. So many choices. So many choices. Not enough, not enough money. Mississippi Masila. I need to get that one at some point. We got Michelle over here trying to build up her pop collection. Angela Pickles. I literally oh, just it? shared um, a reel on Instagram where somebody dressed up like her doll. Did you no. see it? No, I don't think so. Yeah. I was a big Rugrats fan, so. Rugrats. Loved it. Well, are you going to get it? Elliot. That's cute. Oh, you do. Ken's is there, do favorite they have, movie. Do they have any E.T. ones? Do they have the E.T. in the robe? I don't know. super cute et and robe nice yeah how much are these 11.99 all right we're out of uh barnes and noble and i did stick to my plan i only got three okay i only got three are you proud of me i am because i almost got like five or six Yay. but i didn't i didn't do it uh so the three that i got i got uh, get? buck and the preacher i got buck and the preacher this is a film Starring and directed by Sidney Poitier. And a fun fact about this movie, they actually had the poster to this in the movie Nope. It was in the background. Oh, that's cool. Um, so this one came out, I think, in August. I wanted to get it in August, but I was like, I don't need to get it in August. I can wait. Um, and it looks like a cool Western. I've heard some good things about it. So You do like your Western. So. I'll, I'll watch it in West. I'm going to do Western Month Part 2 at some point. At some point I will. So this is the big one. Okay. This is the one that I've been looking for. I've had close encounters and run-ins with this one, I feel like, for the better part of two years. Been wanting to get it ever since I watched the movie on HBO Max for the first time. This is Blood Simple. Hmm. Finally found it today. It's in good condition. Uh, so I had it in my cart like a couple of sales ago, and like yeah. it sold out. Uh, so I, I didn't get it then. I found it in Barnes & Noble last week. There were cracks and holes in it, uh -huh. so I didn't get it then. And now I finally got Blood Simple. Okay. In the collection, this is a film directed by the Coen Brothers from 1984, and it is freaking awesome. I love this movie, so happy to have it in the collection now. And then I got Parasite. You remember Parasite? We watched that movie. I wouldn't mind to watch that again. So I this has a Blu-ray and a 4K, but it also has this Criterion Blu-ray edition with the cool like digipack. Yeah. Um, you know, kind of. Um, you know, see through holes what, what in it. What are you trying to say? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. But it, it's <laughs> yeah, got a cool a hole. cover with mm -hmm. a bunch of holes and stuff. Yeah, uh, very you can good see movie. some stuff in the background. So I've been wanting to get this for a while. It's just, it's hard to double or to get, you know, multiple copies of something. Like if I already have it in the collection, it's hard for me to, to get the well, Criterion yeah. version. But apparently, this, it, it's got a bunch of special features. You can actually watch the movie in black and white on this edition. Like you can switch back and forth. Uh, so that's a cool feature to it. And it's a new 4K uh, digital master. From what I've heard, like, it actually looks... Some people would say it looks better than the 4K. 
uh, that was put out on this one. So <laughs> I don't know. All right. Um, so that's, so uh, that's how, a much, three. how much was your total there? Um, it was uh, 63 or 64 or whatever it was. So for, for, they were 20 bucks a piece. Okay. So, right. and most of these go for $27, $28. For some reason in my mind, I was price. thinking that with the sale, they would all be 15 but they're more than I thought. Uh, if I got DVDs, they'd be 15 Yeah. 4Ks are, would be $25. Um, and, and yeah. Okay. So, but no, 20 bucks a piece. And, you know, I said that you can buy a lot of Criterions anyway for like 22 bucks. These are all ones that are like 27 28 usually, even on Amazon, so... I feel justified in my purchases here today, but that is the uh, Criterion 50% off uh, trip. This will probably be my last trip, my second and last trip. I went to both the Barnes and Nobles in my area, so I feel like I've done my due diligence for the November Criterion sale. Comment down below if you picked up anything cool during the Criterion sale month. I'd definitely love to hear it. Yeah. Uh, like this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and also... Uh, subscribe to our channel, Married With Media. I don't know if I promoted that yet. You didn't. Uh, but, you know, promote it. Tell the, tell the people why they should subscribe to you know, Married if, With Media. I'm going to well, let you sell the channel if you, for once. Do it. If you would quit talking, okay. per usual, can't get Ken to ever shut up, you guys. So if you want to see some more, you know, bickering between the two. Um, I don't know if that's a good selling um, point. <laughs> Yeah, just come on over to our channel. We do lots of movie reviews, TV, Put the uh, camera on you. TV series reviews. Um, we do some fun live streams, uh, all kinds of fun stuff over on our channel. So just you know, come on over, hit the subscribe button. Yeah, the, check that that subscribe out. link is always down below. Yeah, and we really, really need your help to hit 2K before the end. 2K uh, of 2022. That is and our goal. I forgot the like biggest selling point, obviously, myself. If you want to see me more, yeah, you see, you guys see me all the time. That that's the selling, that's the draw to Married with Media. Right here is all Michelle. This. Come on over to Married with Media. Yeah, absolutely. So yeah, that's the Criterion Hunt. I don't know when I'm when I'm gonna put this out. I think I'm gonna put this out during like my peak season. So this will go up probably in a week or two from now. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, appreciate you guys watching. Subscribe, like, comment, turn on the bells. Follow me on all my social media accounts down below. Subscribe to Mary with Media. We'll see you next time. Bye, guys.